Hi. Uh, my introduction video for you. Um, <laughs> it's just little things always happen. Kids start crying, and I have to give kisses and fix boo boos. Yeah, my read this. They're full of energy this morning. It is Thursday morning. Anthony's back to work, and we're back to somewhat of a hopefully irregular schedule now. We're like waking up, going to bed, and all the little things. Um, yeah, so I don't have super big plans yet. I'll probably carve some pumpkins. Um, maybe. Depends on when Anthony gets home from work today. If he can some light. Then we on today. Uh, and then we'll do it this weekend. Uh, otherwise, I have a, some knitting to do. Um, yeah. But besides that, no big plans yet. Oh, the kids will probably go outside later um, after the nap. And um, yeah, because it looks like it's going to be another gorgeous day out. And once it's warmed up, they don't need jackets and stuff. And what I wanted to show you guys for a couple days already is yeah. some yarn I got out of a deep stash from um, someone who's moving here from my young group. Um, and actually, she's a dyer. Um, because of the rules here, we can't have homes, businesses. Um, so she didn't um, have a business. She may be um, opening it back up um, when she's in her new college, uh, location. So the yarn is, the company is called Mad Sage Yarns. Um, of course, I'm not focusing on it. So Mad Sage Yarns love the yarn, own the colors. Um, and I got a few skeins. So let me show you. Uh, I got two skins of this. It's called Cherry Blossom. It's a DK weight. Um, uh, 246 yards and 100 grams. And then I have two skins of this. Gray pink. Um, which is also in a DK weight. And it's called Steely Cotton Candy. And I thought these go well together. Um, and of course, schemes I can make either two smaller projects or one bigger project. Sorry, I got a little grabby baby fingers here. Then I got two schemes of this color. Um, do the green. And the yellow purple. It's called Mardi Gras. I got two of these. They're also in a DK make. And then this red skin without a label, and uh, the baby had it in his fingers, so please ignore how it looks. Yeah, and then this red, which uh, shows up quite a bit lighter than it actually is. It's quite a nice dark, burgundy, like the red winey um, red. So that I'm super excited about. I love them. Um, and we'll see what I make out of them. I have a few ideas, but nothing too quickly. So now, um, I'm gonna go and do some stuff and check in with you guys later.
sieben, acht, neun.